How to lose your voice fast. If you wish to lose your voice fast without resorting to smoking or getting a cold, take measures to hinder your vocal cords. Exert your voice by screaming, singing, whispering, coughing, clearing your throat, or attending sports events or loud concerts. Eat and drink things that may diminish your voice e.g. acidic, salty, and fatty foods, or caffeine or alcohol. Expose yourself to heat, cold, and loud ambient noise. Exerting your voice. Whisper as much as possible. While whispering might seem like a method of preserving one's voice, it actually puts much more strain on your vocal cords than speaking normally does. Whispering also has a drying effect that can cause voice loss. Take every opportunity to whisper instead of talking at a regular volume by pretending that you need to be discreet during conversations, or by starting discussions in quiet places e.g. a library. Scream into a pillow. Screaming at the top of your lungs is the most effective way to lose your voice. Find a thick pillow to scream into to muffle the bulk of the noise, preferably when no one else is close enough to hear it and be concerned. Continue until your voice feels raspy, and stop if you experience pain. Sing karaoke. While professional singers generally warm up their voices before performing, amateur singers have a tendency to wear out their voices by singing too loudly and out of pitch. Spend an evening doing karaoke with friends to enjoy yourself while trying to lose your voice. The act of projecting your voice to fill a room or hall is very likely to cause bruising or swelling of your vocal cords, resulting in temporary laryngitis. Clear your throat or cough. Coughing or clearing your throat can put a strain on your larynx, diminishing your voice. Excessive coughing commonly causes laryngitis, either in the short term or long term. To lose your voice fast, prompt yourself to cough, or clear your voice repetitively until it becomes hoarse and raspy. Attend a concert or sports event. Lose your voice in a fun way by attending a loud concert or sporting event. Get into the action and cheer, sing along, or scream as much as possible. While losing one's voice is often considered a downside of these fun experiences, it can be seen as a success when that is your ultimate goal. Visiting a dance club, attending a demonstration, or going go-karting are also options for loud activities that encourage voice exertion. Visiting a dance club, attending a demonstration, or going go-karting are also options for loud activities that encourage voice exertion.